mis 10 comidas favoritas de América Latina. My favorite 10 dishes from Latin America. And good morning, and welcome to another beautiful day here in my backyard. Today I'm going to explain to you 10 of my favorite dishes here in Latin America. And sometimes when you think of Latin America, you don't include Brazil, but today I'm going to include Brazil because they have so many good dishes as well. And we're gonna go from Chile, Argentina, all the way up to Costa Rica, maybe even Mexico. So let me know in the comments below what you think is the best dish in Latin America and how it compares to where you live. Maybe you live in the United States, maybe you live in Europe. How do these dishes compare to Europe or the United States? And can you find these dishes in those places? I'm curious to find out. Let me know in the comments below. Here we go. Number 10, the marraqueta. I can't go anywhere without talking about the marraqueta. It's so delicious. I love it so, so much. It's this bread that's a salty bread that you can find anywhere in Chile. And also I found out in London, you can find it there as well. You can find it in Quito, Ecuador. You can find it all over the place. And I think that Bolivia, you can find it almost anywhere as well. The marraqueta is my number 10. And Maybe my number one some days, I love it, with some avocado, some meat, some, well, anything. Just give me some marraqueta. Number nine, the ceviche in Peru and in Ecuador as well. Ceviche is one of the most popular Latin American dishes that you can find across the coastal areas of South and Central America. Even in Chile, you can find some ceviche, which is also good. Each country has its own take on this raw fish, but none do it quite like Peru, where this dish got its start. Peruvian ceviche is usually made of fresh raw seafood, usually white fish, that's cured in citrus juice and, oh my goodness, mixed with this onion and coriander or cilantro. It's so delicious. Here in Ecuador, they even make it with shrimp, which is also really good. Number eight empanadas in Argentina and Chile. A pocket of pastry filled with tasty, savory fillings. What's not to love about this beautiful, delicious empanada? The crunchy half moon pastry is common in Argentina, but Chile has the empanada de pino, and I love this one as well. It's filled with some meat and maybe vegetables and cheese, and for me, I like it with chicken, or sometimes there's a pizza type of a flavor, Napolitana. And oh my goodness, this is just a street food that you cannot miss. Number seven, Cozingas, I think that's how you say it. In Brazil, they speak Portuguese, I don't know. When hunger strikes in Brazil, you look for Cozinas to cure your hunger pangs. This teardrop shaped fried snack has pulled chicken at the very center. It's so delicious and wrapped in a layer of dough and dusted with a little bit of breadcrumbs. How does this not exist in other parts of Latin America or in the United States? Number six, steak in the southern countries of Latin America. South American beef is so highly regarded that the meat is frequently shipped across the globe and found in supermarkets and restaurants in Europe, Asia, and Australia. While exploring South America cuisine, treat yourself to a meal out and try the bife de lomo with chimichurri in Argentina or salty picana in Brazil. Super good. Number five, my wife's favorite, the arepas in Venezuela or Colombia. Arepas are one of the best foods I think you can find in all of Latin America. It's a flat bread-like sandwich made from corn dough, and you'll find them filled with everything from cheese to meat to eggs. Simple arepas from Colombia make for a great snack, while heartier ones, like those from Venezuela, often come filled with meat, beans, avocado, eggs, and more. Number four, super healthy and delicious, acai bowl in Brazil. On a hot, humid day in Brazil, nothing's better than an icy acai bowl. This popular and healthy Latin America dish combines rich, deep purple acai berry, and most of the berries come from Brazil, and they're mixed with banana and fruits, 
and the frozen mixture basically tastes like dark berries mixed with cacao. The bowls are topped usually with some slices of fruit and sometimes a sprinkle of granola, shaved coconut, seeds and nuts, low calories and uh, highly refreshing. It's the ultimate summer seaside treat. And I love it in the United States too. I know you can find it. Number three, anticuchos in Bolivia or Peru. Eating street food is the best way to get to know South American cuisine. Anticuchos is a food to try in Latin America that is native to both Bolivia and Peru. Typically, you'll receive a bowl with strips of grilled beef heart. Yes, heart. Or beef heart kebabs. Cooked over the grill and served with potatoes and ají sauce, this meat will have been marinated in a mix of chili garlic, cumin, vinegar, salt, and pepper. Super good, but yes, it is hard. Number two, gallo pinto in Costa Rica. Beans are a staple in South America cuisine, and in Costa Rica, you'll enjoy them in common dishes, and this one I particularly like called gallo pinto. This hearty combination of rice, beans, and a traditional seasoning called lisano will fill you up and give you the energy to explore this beautiful place in Costa Rica. Number one. Number one, my favorite dish that I've found is pastel de choclo in Chile. This food to try in Latin America is actually more like a tasty, rich meat casserole. It's always topped with a corn crust and sometimes finished with sliced boiled eggs and a light topping of sugar, I prefer salt, and some tomatoes, and it's a comfort food at its best. These are my top 10 foods. I love these foods so much, and if you're coming to Latin America and any of these countries, I think you're not going to go wrong with any of these top 10. What's your top 10 list of foods in Latin America? What's your top 10 list of foods in your country? There are so many good foods you know from this channel that I love foods and my goodness, this channel is almost all foods and travel. So follow me, enjoy the trips and enjoy the foods wherever you're going, wherever you live. And I hope that you enjoyed this video. Check me out on Instagram and TikTok. All those links are right below. I have a new website coming out really, really soon as well. I'm excited to share that with you all. And also check below if you're coming to Latin America, I have some eSIM cards at 5% off right now. So check those out. All those links are right below and we'll see you guys next time. But for now, here's a Chilean phrase that I started about seven years ago and it's still stuck. It means basically see you later alligator, but uh, it's usually for kids and it's kind of a joke. Ciao, Piscow.